Our Eve, promoting the game and its players. Hey there, my name is Johnny Pugh, in-game character name Sir Livingston, and welcome to Our Eve. Today I'm on the Singularity Test Server to give you a brief video demonstration of a new custom probe formation feature that's coming with Odyssey 1.1. Now, Odyssey 1.1, the release date has yet to be announced. We do not know when this feature is going to come to Tranquility, but I'm here on Singularity to show you, give you a brief demonstration of the feature. This is the custom probe formation. Now, as you can see on the probe scan window, we have all of our buttons here. We're going to go ahead and launch eight probes. Here we are, eight probes out. We got our standard buttons, analyze, recall, reconnect, disconnect, standard default, standard, um, this is default spread, default pinpoint, and here we are, the new button, the new custom probe formation button. Let's go ahead and delete my other two right here. Custom probe formation, right? I'm gonna go into my probe window to work on this. It defaults, this defaulted to my last, my last one. That was terrible. Okay, defaults. Let's go with default spread. Default spread. You can save up to 10. 10 custom pro formations. And all you gotta do is it even saves the sizes, the sizes of your probes for that particular formation. I'm going to change something here. Let's go say I didn't like the spread formation. I'm gonna create my own default spread formation. I'm gonna go hold shift. I'm gonna move this one slightly up, this one slightly down. I'm going to bring this one in, this one in, that one in, that one in there, you get it. And I'm going to enlarge all of them. Oh, I'm so used to using shift for everything. Okay, so there we go. New default spread, uh, spread formation for me. I'm gonna create a custom and I'm gonna save it. So here we are. Save um, new spread formation. Save, okay. Here we are. It's right there. New spread formation. It's saved. So I'm going to go show the difference. This is the old default spread. There we go. And here's my new custom one that I just saved. There we go. Now we can scan just like normal with our new custom pro formation that we saved. Now, to be honest, this isn't going to be entirely useful for those who uh, do PVE scanning primarily. This is more of a PVP feature because in PVP, I, I can see multiple types of formations being useful. But in PVE, it's so simple and predictable that I do not believe you will need custom formations to do so. So PVP, this is where I see this feature coming into use. So to be honest, default spread and pinpoint are all that I really need for most of my activities since I do not do much combat probing. And if I am combat probing, usually I'm dropping core probes and scanning down the site that the person's in, not his ship. At least that gives him less of a, uh, uh, give him less of a reason to assume I'm coming after him. That's it. That's the feature. Very simple, uh, but very useful to those who are going to get into combat pvp you can create your own custom formations figure out what works best for you for probing down ships fast and uh, anything you want to do it's very simple i'm going to go create another formation here and go through and save it um, this is a spread formation as uh, pinpoint default pinpoint let's see do it again and i'm going to let's see yeah, I'm going to create my own custom pinpoint position. Say I don't like exactly what this uh, default pinpoint is. I'm going to go ahead and bring this one slightly in. That one slightly in. Let's see. I don't, like, if you're one of those people who use one of those uh, unbonused hauls, then sometimes you need that fine touch, that fine bit of bringing in your probes to get that 1%, that 2%, that maybe one less than 1% to get to 100% hit on your PVE site. So this can be useful for you so you don't have to make that slight little adjustment to every single probe and waste your time. So I'm going to save this as new pinpoint, new pinpoint formation. There we go, saved. Go ahead, saved right there, new spread. That's the one I made earlier, new pinpoint. I'm gonna go with default to the old pinpoint. And here is my new pinpoint. There we go. That didn't work. There we go, right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and set the probe. Go ahead and analyze. It's that simple. The feature, straightforward, easy to understand. Good job, <laughs> I approve that.
And CCP did say, you know, when they first released these features of default spread and default pinpoint formations, they said they would uh, continue to work on the uh, probing and improve it. And people were saying, hey, man, why can't we just have custom formations? You know, you, you offer these defaults. Well, here we go. Here you go. We got default and custom formations now. Let's see, let's probe down this site and see what we have. This is on the test server, by the way, so it's not really that useful to us. I'm using my own custom pinpoint. It's not the best. <laughs> It's been so long since I ever did my own custom probe formation because I'm so used to the defaults now. It's simple for me. I don't do much combat probing, so the default pinpoint and spread have been sufficient for me. Actually, I rarely use the spread formation because when you open up your map, it'll show you an estimate of where the site actually, oh, data site, of where the site is. So you can go straight into pinpoint mode, forget spread, spread mode, and then just go right into the site. But I can understand if it's a really large system, hundreds, uh, hundred plus AU size system, then I can see spread formation being useful. Oh, someone told me you don't need to do that. You can just double click. Bad habits die hard. Sit, finish up this site. That's it for the custom port formation. That's as much as I'm going to show you. That's all that is. All that's there. All that's new. So there you go. I'm going to go warp to this site real quick. I love warp and decise here. Oh, there you go. Pop it up. Just like at all times. Regional Garista Data Processing Center. Okay. Let's recall probes. Save this thing. That's it, everyone. Hope you enjoyed this brief demonstration of the new custom probe formation that's coming with Odyssey 1.1. The release date has yet to be announced, so be patient. Thank you so much for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time.